What's up, brother Mike? Hey, Eric, you know how to make an entrance, huh? Sup, what's up, wasabi? Hey, everybody, welcome to Chill Japan. I'm sitting here with uh, Eric from Eric Surf 6. Hey, how's it going, guys? We're in the local surf supermarket. Not a surf market, a supermarket. But well, we are surfers at the supermarket. At the supermarket. So, uh, what was it? Two, three weeks ago, we did a, a semi collab video. Barbecue? A Hawaiian barbecue. Backyard barbecue. That was yeah. awesome. Yeah, I, uh, I got some comments. Oh, you got some comments. We got some comments. We did? Uh, about uh, the food and how to cook it and how to make it and prepare and stuff like that. So I thought maybe we'd do a little collab. Come to the supermarket, go shopping. What do you think? Put me to work in the kitchen. Okay, today we're going to show you how to make some Hawaiian huli huli chicken. Ooh, huli huli. Everybody, we're in the supermarket. So, for huli huli chicken, we need chicken, mm -hmm. white wine, ketchup, Worcestershire sauce, garlic, ginger, and some pineapple. Okay. So you I'll, take half the list and go. I'll get the beers. <laughs> so important things first. What kind of beer do you prefer? So far it's pretty good, right? I prefer Chew Heights now. So. <laughs> Why you got to make it difficult? Don't tell, me, don't tell me because I know exactly which ones you like. These guys, seven percenters. Bingo. Right there for you. Do these work? Yeah. 20% off. Should we get those? Okay. How's that? Should be good. Three of them will be enough? You, this guy. Spain. This guy looks legit. I like his hairstyle. Spanish garlic? No. Hey, how many you have for the weekend? You work at a supermarket, you're right, kid. Maybe a little bit of rouge. Rouge? You mean like foundation? No, that, that's somebody spilled on there, right? Yeah, but a lot of people have been touching it, right? <laughs> <laughs> you started it giving me this. Yep, it's all my fault. In three. Everybody, Two. welcome to Chill Japan's Kitchen. I'm Mike. Over here, we got Eric. Hey, what's going on, Red? We're a hey, purple, or is it magenta? We are colorful. Yes, we are. Get some of that. What is on the menu for this evening? We are making huli huli chicken. What exactly does huli huli mean? Huli means, this is a very, um, this is one of those things that people don't actually understand. They, they understand. they think that huli huli chicken, the huli huli is the sauce, but huli huli just means to turn around and around and around. Ah, okay. So like with, with hula, mm -hmm. if, if you're, you're a hula sensei, Kumu says huli, that means to turn. Oh, same, okay. Yeah, right. All so right. huli huli just means to turn over and over again. That's why when you go to Hawaii, it's on the rotisserie, right. rotisserie chicken. But the smell and the marination, oh, yeah. and I mean, that's a big part of it too. It's not that, it's the charcoal, the keabe. Oh, really? Oh, no, yeah, the charcoal is there. It's okay. just, it's a different world, right? And you know, all the good ingredients, which we we went to the store and we got? Yep. So today's, today's huli huli chicken. And once again, huli huli chicken, there's a hundred ways to make it. Huli huli is not the sauce, it's the way that it's made, going around and around. So today we got a really simple one. It's gonna be made with white wine. Some Worcester sauce. You're not gonna be used to this one, but this is like the Japanese style Worcester so Worcester so 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 sauce. And uh, some ketchup. The ever popular pineapple. Mm. And of course, some garlic and some ginger. And we're just gonna throw this in the food processor, the mixer, whatever, whatever you have, and blend it up. We're gonna take the chicken, put it in it, put it in a baggie, soak it overnight. It's as simple as it. So overnight you soak it and it's ready to put on the barbecue? Oh, or? Yeah. Okay, the gotcha. Yeah, yeah. So when you were in the islands, where, did you have a favorite place to, uh, to eat huli huli chicken? On the North Shore. Yeah, yeah I would just... drive on the Cam Highway and you smell it first and then you see it. And then you pull in, you stand in line, you get it. It's yeah. that popular. And yeah. Yeah, it's, it's that, a rage. That's the great thing because it was all the, the school fundraisers. Oh yeah, that's how they make right. they make money in the that's fundraising. Right. So yeah. when they're, wherever you're driving, they have huli huli chicken going on the side. Of the on road. a weekend, always. Yeah. And the recipes are different. They're always good. There's it's never a bad one. Yeah. And it's just a big tractor trailer kind of with all the charcoal. Yeah, and it's pretty interesting to see. Yeah. yeah, maybe we could uh, put some B-roll in here somewhere. I think we have hey, some. We so we're back and. Um, I think we should start making some sauce. What do you think? Yep. You can put the that. chicken down. You don't have to hold it. It's okay. Just put it back. Or you can throw some in the bowl. It's going to go in here and eat eventually. Okay. Okay. I'll do that. 
while you start preparing the sauce. Well, I know you have. So anyway, so I'm gonna take the the pineapples. I'm gonna throw them in like, like this. Now the uh, the syrup. It is completely up to you. It just if you want it really sweet, more syrup. I tend to like to go with just the pineapple, but what do you think? Do you want a, you want a little bit of that in there? I do. You want all, want all of it in there? I do. Oh, yeah, I, I like okay. my hula hula chicken sweet. There you go. Like me. Excuse me. Yeah, you're right. And from there. Oh. Yeah. Maybe we don't need the uh, the salt. The what do you what do you call it? The syrup. Yeah. Yeah. So pretty much standard Heinz ketchup. Yeah. You know, which is also like 100% sugar. So. But we're just gonna put the ketchup in, and is it, is ketchup really that 100 percent sure it's oh it's, yeah it's horrible, huh? Not that not that it's a bad thing. It's just I thought it was made from tomatoes. Yeah right. No tomato ketchup. Is There's it? some tomato in there somewhere. Yes. Oh okay. god. But can't go wrong with cooking with it. All right. So that was, I don't know how big this bottle is. It's 460 you, grams. You so put all of it? No, it's half of it. Okay. Yeah. And then, very, very important, white wine. Why is that important? Wine is always we, important. We got two highs. Hold on. I'll drink to that. Okole Maluna. And these don't have any sugar, right? Nope. That's You turned me on to these, and I've been losing weight, man. I was drinking beer before, and, and two highs with the sugar. Yep. Yeah, sugar is the enemy. Mm. Except when you're cooking. That's right. Okay, so wine. And the Worcester sauce. Worcester. That's how they say it in Japanese. Worst, yeah, it's called Worcester. But in English, in English it's, um, it's... I can't even say it. Worcester. Worcestershire. 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 Worcester the worst sauce ever. There we go. Like that. Did you shake it up? Or does it, does it need to be shaken up? Before you came in. Came in and was shaking it. Some garlic? No, no. Oh, okay. Just a little bit. Just see if it. Just a little see that's thicker, isn't it? No? No, it's because it's not the thick kind, it's the thin kind we bought. Okay, so it doesn't matter. Yeah. Okay. Throw some ginger in there. And where's my lid? Here it is. Yeah, you gotta have the lid on there. And look at the beautiful color on that. And that's it. It looks like a sweet and, sweet and sour sauce, doesn't it? Which is basically what it is, if you think about it. Okay. So now, we're going to take the sauce. Oh, it looks like chili sauce. That's what it's supposed to be. Put this in the sink. Can I smell here. it? Yeah. And I'm going to give you the spoon. You can mix that up. Okay. And then, how long do you recommend that it gets marinated for? You refrigerate it? The longer the, longer, the better. The longer the better is the best. Like two answer. or three days? Uh, maybe too long, but um, I, overnight for sure. Okay. Yeah. Um, I would make it a, a day and a half out. A day and a half out. Yeah, if you can. Which is perfect. Yeah. And the okay. best way to do this is just you know mix it up in the bowl, let it sit, and then I know they're around here somewhere. Where they are? Where they are? You just take a big Ziploc bag, put them in the Ziploc bag. Those um, are the yeah. freezer bags, the yeah. thick ones? Okay. Yeah. And put them in, throw them in the fridge. When you're going to the barbecue, into the cooler, you're good to go. And you also should go check out the collab that's on my channel that we did together. We yes. went to this amazing fish restaurant. That was good. Oh my gosh, that was like best meal of my life for a fish restaurant. That was, and we had the sashimi, we did the raw fish. Like six kinds of sashimi. <sighs> And, it, and most of them I didn't know. Like, I haven't had those exact varieties of fish before. Yeah, two of them I didn't know, yeah. Right? And then we had the the rock fish cooked in this really sweet sauce. And then the beers were flowing, too. The beer was flowing. And it was Teishoku style. So yeah. we had the, it's what, the rice and the miso soup. And the tofu. And the tofu came with it. And yeah. you can check the link. And one of these That's right, there. it's over here. It's, over I think here? it's on the side. Yep, okay. yep. It's always above Mike's head there. Yeah. Okay, I always get that wrong. So, so definitely go take a look at that, guys. Appreciate it. You know, this new studio light you got in here, it's way too bright. Yeah, I know. You got any sunglasses? It's hot, too. It's hot, too. It's like summer out. I don't mind the hot, but just it's just so bright. I think we need sunglasses. What sunglasses? Yeah. Can I wear the green ones? Yeah, you can have. You can wear them, but you can't keep them. <laughs> it's 
So running now that up. now that I got them on my face, I'm feeling pretty close to keeping them. They're looking pretty stylish on you, but you can't have them. Okay. All you right. can only wear them when you're here. Okay, fair you're enough. The Chill Japan headquarters. I will somewhere find my own green sunglasses okay. online. Big come play. Okay. Thank you, Eric. You're very welcome. It's a pleasure to be here because I like to eat your food. I like to eat my food too. Okay. Can't thank go you. wrong with that. So, but I'd like to say thank you again. Goodbye. Always a pleasure. And we'll see you again very soon on Chill Japan. Oh, oh, sure. Oh, do. I get the mini, yeah. Don't do the side, y'all. Bye. 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 Okay. Uh, like, uh, that's all you can eat? No, I think I you need You said more. you're starving. Yeah. yeah, it's super good. Okay, I'm just yeah. going to eat right off of this. Okay, sorry, take two. Mm. Oh. <laughs> what can I say? Best day of my life. This is... Thanks for joining us at Chill Japan. Be sure to like, share, and follow. And by all means, leave a comment down below. We'd love to hear from you. For more information on any of our videos, check out our homepage at chilljapan.jp.